towards big stuff. I'm kind of scared. I'm moving to a different location. And I don't know anybody there. get more opportunities and more excitement for sure. Yeah, you get a lot more freedom. You're allowed to stand outside yes. before class. <laughs> you don't have to walk in a straight line to lunch. Yeah, you just pretty much spread out. You don't have assigned seats. You can do your own thing. The people are a lot more mature. Um, as, as we've grown up. I find that middle school has been more fun than elementary school because you live like a lot more people and they're all different ages. You have a lot more clubs, more variety of, I don't know, ways to meet people. Extracurricular clubs are a must. So, you dressed up as a cheerleader. I was the, I was the first uh, cheerleader for homecoming, what is it? Powder Puff. Your teachers know that you're just getting into high school and they're not as hard on you. And there's AP classes that you can take so you can specify which areas you want to go into and have kind of your, your group of friends with you. Make sure you get on your teacher's good side because they always love a teacher's pet. And you gotta stay focused, you can't fool around or anything. And you have different teachers and you know, a lot of homework. Homework all, every single day, even the Fridays, weekends, yeah, it's going to be difficult. I don't want to go to middle school. I think it's going to be fun. In a higher grade, they get more and more hard on you because you're actually going to college. You're, they're preparing you for it. Excited because it's a different environment. Um, nervous because it's a different environment. I mean, you know, not everybody's not going to be like all together. It's going to be like separate. Everybody, you're kind of leaving most of your friends here. Yeah. And you're like moving out. Once again, I feel like that eighth grader back in middle school. I'm scared because now I have to be even more independent. Well, I've been accepted to the United States Air Force Academy. So I'll be going there, I report July 11th. And then I'll uh, go into the military. And I'm hoping to do legal studies and get a law degree through there. And then go on and do my time in the service and then retire as a civilian and continue law. I've had a lot of friends that gave up during those four years and just left, but that's so easy to do. It's, it's worth it to keep going on and working very hard, because I look back now as a senior and say, I could have worked even harder. I have two brothers that go to, to high school, so they got, they got my back. <laughs> I guess if I, as long as I hang out with the other ninth graders, freshmen, we'll all be one big group of freshmen of ankle biters. <laughs>